follow me in this spinning and striking review. And as a bonus at the very end, I'm gonna show you a new way to do the hand roll and a special move. Start with your chucks in your right hand, right foot forward, and start right away in the figure eight. Now you're just gonna switch hands, doesn't matter how you do it, just grab with the other hand, left foot forward, left hand, figure eight. Switch back, you're gonna go into your reverse figure eight. Don't worry too much about the switches yet, you'll get those in a minute. And then to the other hand, your reverse figure eight. And now with your left hand, I want you to strike down and up, down and up. When you go down, your hand opens. See how my thumb pops up this way? Your fingers come up. This is a natural break. If you keep your hand closed, when you come down, the chuck is gonna bust you in the knuckles. That's okay if you like the pain, but open your hand to avoid it. So when you come down, open your hand, and that's gonna slow it down and keep it from smacking you in your hand opens up on the way down. So you're going down and up. This is your right hand, your right foot is forward, and now across the body. Think of temple to cheek, think of clavicle, think of the ribs. And again, when you come down and do that strike, open here, bringing it to a stop. You keep it closed when you get to the end of the motion, it has to go somewhere, it's gonna come back and hit your hand. So learn how to do the technique right. When you're down, bring it across. Notice that my big finger, my first finger is pointing down, my thumb is pointing down, and I'm bringing it across my hip. Switch it to the other hand, again, don't worry about the switches yet, just down and up, open the hand. Think about striking right through the forehead, right here, down and up. Maybe they pull out a gun, whack them in the hand. Don't take a pair of nunchucks to a gunfight, but you never know. Come down and then across and back. You're gonna bring it through to the other hand. You're just doing this transfer in front of your body. Do a couple of figure eights. Now I want you to reverse it, and I want you to pull it in to you this way. This motion of reversing when it comes to the inside here, here, that's where you just put the hand on the inside. And now the same thing, but a little bit bigger, going forward in the figure eight, and bringing it behind your back. And now reversing. Now to the hand roll. When you bring it to the side, you just open and close your hand. And then the other hand open and close. So here's your new move. You're gonna come across the body with this strike that we did before. Remember to open the fingers on the way down, and then you're coming out this way, knocking, this time they've got a knife. You're gonna knock that knife out of their hand. When you come across, you're gonna open your hand and do your first hand roll instead of on the side of the body here in a different plane parallel to the floor. And then when you come up here, you're gonna do the second hand roll. So it's the same wrist roll or hand roll that you're doing side to side, but we're making it more dynamic by adding a strike and then you're coming across and you're coming back up.
Now here's the setup. You're gonna make yourself a clock. An old style clock. 12 o'clock, six o'clock. One, two, three, four. It's going around. You're gonna let the chuck go, the one you're holding. See how the chuck comes straight like a stick? You're gonna let it go here at 11. And you're gonna catch it first in the same hand. You're gonna throw it. You're just gonna open your hand at 11 and catch it at one. You go the other hand, it's the opposite. Counterclockwise, let it go at one, catch at 11. Make sure that it's doing a full turn in the air. Now, you're gonna go clockwise to the front of your body. This is my right hand. I'm on the front of my body, which is the left side, and I'm gonna let it go at 11. Let it do that turn and catch it with the other hand at one. That's the motion. Then switch feet and go counterclockwise. Let it go over here, catch it with the other hand. Throw it and catch it. Start again, throw, catch, same hand, and then with the other hand. Reverse, throw, same hand, and then the other hand. Figure eight, throw and catch, throw and catch. Take your lumps, I got a lot of them this time. Take your lumps, but don't quit. Remember to leave me comments, like, subscribe if you haven't done so already. And please share this with somebody else who wants to learn this technique. I'll see you the next time.